So we all have those old fashion magazines laying around our house and I figured why not wear one of them? So today I'm going to show you how to take your old fashion magazines and not only wear the styles they insist inside of them, but actually wear the magazines themselves in this fun and easy do-it-yourself magazine nail tutorial. Let's get critter crafty! Okay, so first you're definitely going to need one of your favorite fashion magazines and I'm going to be using Seventeen magazine for this tutorial because it is my favorite fashion magazine. And all I'm doing is I'm going through the pages and I'm looking for really pretty fonted words and really colorful words, something that's going to really stand out on my nails. And I'm just snipping them out, snippity snippity. As you can see, I've chosen the word 17 because, you know, I love the word 17. Hello, Glitter Forever 17. <laughs> but anyway, I'm just finding some really pretty graphics and such that I think would really stand out on my nails. And also, here's like their website, something like that, and it's the color red. Here's some examples of some different graphics and such that you could also apply to your nails. And I'm also using the table of contents for the black text. And here's a layout of all the different little things you can put on your nails. Time to nail this look! Okay, so now that you're done cutting out all those little pretties for your nails, I'm going to start by applying a base coat. And what this does is it protects your nails from getting stained from the polish. And I'm not really sure if white would stain your nails, but hey, just do it and don't argue with me. Okay, so now I'm just arguing with myself. But anyway, it also makes your polish last a lot longer without all those little chipperly chippertons happening. So next you want to apply any white nail polish. And I chose white for this because it's going to make all the words and graphics appear a lot more vibrant and just glitterific. And you can also experiment with other colors if you want to. I'd love to see maybe some pinks or blues or something like that. It just depends on whatever color graphics or text you're going to apply to your nails. And the options are pretty much endless. Do -do 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 -do. Random singing out in the middle of this video. Okay, so be sure and touch up any mistakes you make because you got to be careful with white polish because you don't want it looking like globs of white out on your nails. And after, just let them dry. Okay, so after your nails are dry, you just want to take a glass bowl and some rubbing alcohol. Just fill it up to where it just covers the bottom of the bowl. And I'm also taking some tweezers, and this is what I'm going to use to hold the magazine clipping. So I'm just taking the clipping and soaking it into the alcohol for a few seconds. Then I'm just going to gently lay it on my nail and press it down for around, I don't know, 10, 15 seconds, something like that. And this way it'll just ensure that the ink is going to stick to your nail. And just gently remove it with the tweezers and it is as simple as that. Mm -hmm. So next I'm just going to add some text to the nail as well. And what this does is it just sort of gives it a little contrast. So that way you can have smaller text and then larger text. And I just think that it looks really cute. So just have fun experimenting with this. I mean, you can use whatever graphics you want. You can add as many graphics as you want to one ma male nail. One male, I don't know what I'm talking about. And also, you don't have to come out perfect on each nail because goodness knows I didn't. Because sometimes the ink won't stick all the way, but that's okay. Because it kind of gives your nails a grungy, vintage-like look. So that's kind of like how I like to look at it instead of saying to myself, Oh my gosh, Bailey, you just totally messed this up. It kind of makes me feel better. But really, it does look good whenever it is kind of grungy looking like that. And also another tip, if you want it to look extremely perfect and you want the ink to come out perfect, you can also make sure your nails are kind of tacky and don't let them dry all the way and that'll ensure that the ink sticks a whole lot better so i learned that from experience but anyway keep watching to continue watching me do my nails okay that sounded really messed up i am not good at wording things y'all so anyway let me stop rambling and let's get to the next hand okay because i've already rambled through the first hand and i'm sure you're sick of hearing my voice already but Okay, okay, this narration's horrible. Cue the music! You never know when this random singing's gonna hit you in the middle of the video. I'm back! Okay, so the reason I came back was because I wanted to also let you know that 
using like these different brand names such as Giorgio Armani or whatever other brand names you find inside the magazine, those actually look really cute on your nails. So just a little tidbit, I just couldn't help but adding, but I'm sure you'll find it beneficial. So, as you can see, my nails are already starting to look like the pages of Seventeen magazine, which is so cool because it's like you see all of these familiar things from the magazine and they're on your nails. Your nails are your magazine now. I mean, you could read your nails. You could be like, yeah, I'm just reading Seventeen magazine on my nails. Jealous? Okay, so maybe not, but we are finished doing all the graphics now. And next you want to take a clear coated nail polish and go ahead and add your top coat. And what this does is it seals in all that ink from the magazine and it also gives you a really pretty glossy glitterific finish. We nailed this look to the wall, critters! So I really hope y'all enjoyed this tutorial. Have fun splattering the pages of your favorite fashion magazine on your nails. I know I did. With a great fashion magazine, a little creativity, and a heart full of glitter, the possibilities are endless for this polished look. Thank you for watching and have a glitterful day. Please subscribe, oh please subscribe to become an official glitter critter. And don't forget to add me on 